you get a black screen issue when launching dredge then in this tutorial i will guide you on how to fix this problem so follow this tutorial very carefully but before we begin to our tutorial make sure your computer meet the system requirement used to run dredge so make sure your computer meet the system requirement if your computer doesn't meet the system requirement then you'll also be facing this issue a lot if your computer meet the system requirement and you're still facing the black screen issue then listen to this tutorial very carefully if you get a black screen when launching dredge then in this tutorial i will guide you on how to fix this issue first close the game which is dredge if you have msi afterburner and and rivertuna on your pc simply turn them off and launch the game again the issue should be resolved if you don't want to close msi after banner you can just disable river tuner for the first time then find it dredge or add it manually to river tuner if it's not listed click the add icon or just click the add which is a plus symbol with a green to select the game executable set the application detection level to none for the game, this method keeps MSI Afterburn active for overclocking or undervolting without needing to close it entirely. So if you get a black screen, just make sure if you have MSI Afterburn and River Tuna, just turn off them off on your PC and then launch the game and the issue should be resolved. If you don't have these applications, you're still facing again the black screen, then follow these steps very carefully. Other methods that work, simply turn off cloud saving. So if you have cloud saving, on your epic games launcher just open epic games store and to turn cloud saving just go to your profile icon here which on your profile select profile and then go to settings and then on the preference tab here just scroll on this page and you'll see enable cloud saves so just make sure to uncheck this so if you uncheck it means you turn it off so uncheck it and try to restart the game to see if the issue has been resolved you can also verify your game files now to verify your game files just go on there your epic it depends on where you have downloaded the game so yes if you've downloaded the game on the epic games store just go to your library here so just wait for a few then just on the three dots here select on your game which is dredge select on it and then go to manage and then you'll see the option to verify your game files so select verify and then wait for a few minutes for the verification to finish and then you can try to relaunch the game you can also restart your epic games and pc to see if the issue can help you fix this problem also you can force direct x version try adding negative dx11 and negative dx12 as launch option so you can try to add negative dx11 and negative dx12 as a launch option to see if the issue can help you resolve this problem to add it simply copy one of the following which is negative dx11 then go to epic games launcher on the launch option here you can just paste this just enable it and then paste it here after pasting it it here then try to relaunch the game if it hasn't been solved then you can try to remove it if it has been solved then you can you are good and you can play the game another step you need to try is update your graphics card driver so to update your graphics card driver it depends on what graphics you're using if you're using nvidia you can update your graphics drivers by visit the nvidia website or if you're using amd just visit the amd website and update your graphics driver if it all fails then reinstall the game so freshly reinstall the game to see if the issue has been fixed